Good morning, Wolfpack. I'm Harrison Martin. And I'm Kaylee Ota. Today is Wednesday, September 4th, and we are here with your morning announcements. The new Rock and Roll Club will have an organized meeting tomorrow, September 5th, at 3.30 to 4 p.m. in the band room to draft bylaws and cast a vision of the future of the club. If all interested, students are invited to attend. Homecoming Float Building is this week. Come build to, become, come build to compete for the title of winning float for your class. Freshmen Miss Morlock in HP7, sophomores Miss Herod and Miss Gonzalez in HG5, HJ5, juniors Miss Corbin in HP10, and seniors Miss Wright in HJ, HG3. Are you planning to attend the homecoming dance? This Friday is the last day to attend Friday school and get your name off the no activities list. Please see Miss Candy in the VP office to take care of your detentions. Friday is also the last day to turn in guest passes to the VP office. Coach Fowl is holding preseason wrestling meetings this week in his room, HJ3, immediately after school. Each meeting will last about 10 minutes. He will also discuss preseason pre -season after school, weight training, and wrestling sessions. The sessions are held each day, Monday through Thursday, after school until 5 o'clock p.m. through October 10th. Attention new and returning lead members. Our first meeting will be held tomorrow, September 5th, in HT HM1, 20 in Senior Prayers' room. Please don't be late and be ready to work on our sp club spirit track. Let's pass it on over to Alex and Matthew for your In the News update. What's going on, Wolfpack? I'm Matthew Girona. And I'm Alex McCarty, and we're here with your In the News update. South Carolina Governor Henry McMaster declared a state of emergency, tweeting Tuesday night, there is no more time for hesitation. If you're in an evacuation zone, you need to evacuate now. He expresses, South Carolina coastal areas will see life-threatening storm surge and dangerous winds. In international news, after many months of protest, Hong Kong's leader, Carrie Lam, announced the withdrawal of the extradition bill. This bill would have allowed suspects to be sent to mainland China to face trial, which many civilians from Hong Kong were against. Well, that's all the news we have for you today, Wolfpack. I'm Matthew Girona. And I'm Alex McCarty. Back, Back to, to you, anchors. anchors. Thanks, guys. Let's check out counseling announcements. Seniors and juniors, our first college presentation is scheduled for this Wednesday, September 4th. A presentation from John Hopkins University in Maryland will be here to share the GHU is of what GHU is about and what it takes to be admitted here. Pick up a pass in the Career Center. On Saturday, September 14th, the Historically Black College and University Fair will be held in Monterey Trail High School. The HBCU College Fair House hours are 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. This college-going event is open to EGOC students, seniors. Bring your transcripts, application fee waivers, and on-the-spot admissions are possible. Check your August 27th email from Ms. Caldwell in Career Center for a link to register. All students, Christian colleges from across the nation will be at Sacramento Christian College Fair on Monday, September 23rd, from 6 8 to 8 p.m. at Destiny Christian Church in Rockland. The event is free and includes financial aid sessions. You can pre-register for expected check-in. Check, -in. Check uh, your August 27th email from the Career Center for your registration link. One more for seniors. Starting this Wednesday, September 4th, your counselors will be holding weekly Wednesday morning workshops to help you through college application process. The series of workshops will kick off with this week with the topic, Senior Timeline, What Do You Need to Do and When? Workshops will be held in Career Center and begin at 8. To no need to sign up, just show up. But get there early, seating is limited. The first, college the first college presentation is scheduled for today at 12.30. A representative from John Hopkins University in Maryland will be here to share what John Hopkins University is about and what it takes to be admitted there. Pick up a pass in the Career Center. CSF applications are available in the library for current juniors and seniors. Completed applications will go along with an unofficial transcript and a receipt from the senior store for $1 dues. It will be turned into the Miss Lou in the library before homecoming rally this Friday, September 6. If you were a CSF Wolfpack Hour tutor last year or you, were, or you are a current CSF member who is able to tutor during Wolfpack Hour this term, please pick up your CSF application due before rally this Friday. This week is INCO week. Each day we'll be celebrating one of our words. Today is Responsible Wear College and Career Day Wear. Tuesday and Thursday is Honorable and Friday is Engaged, Sport That Spear Wear. 
Before we go, let's check out how the fall editions went. Well, that's all we have for today, Wolf Pack. I'm Harrison Martin. And I'm Kaylee Ote. Remember, the strength of the pack is the wolf. And the strength of the wolf is the pack. Have, have a, a responsible, responsible Wednesday, Wolf Pack. Wolfpack.